Alright, I'm back. Hey guys, I'm back with uh, chapter 9 this time. It's been a while since I made a new video. Chapter 9. Yeah, we're doing chapter 9, the Pirate Through Dragon. Here in a second. I'm going to try to speak a little louder today. Move, in, move the mic a little closer to my mouth. I don't know. Last, uh, last video. Or last, yeah, last video. I got, I was using a new mic. I'm using Turtle Beaches this time. And they were really, really, really quiet. Which is surprising. And when I play online with my friends, I'm all, they also complain about not being able to hear me. So I'm going to try to speak louder. Hopefully this this is fine, this volume. I don't know, but we're going to start now. So basically, you got to fight this, this dragon dude. Yeah, he's the boss. He's pretty easy to take out. You might as well just use Merrick like before. Um. So yeah. I leveled up Rad to level 10. I was actually able to train him, which makes me really happy. And just compare his stats to Navarre really quick. You can see th there's only a f he's five levels lower, but he already has better defense. One short skill. So yeah, Navarre's or Rad's gonna turn out better probably. So basically, there's two there's two ways you can go here. There's you can open the door and go down here, which looks like it would be quicker. You can go around to a village over here. And go down here, which is really, really, really long route. And there's a chest over here that contains a worm slayer, which is basically a sword that's really, really good for slaying dragons, which is killing this guy. Oh, but there's a thief right here. Where? There's a thief somewhere. He's right here. Now, odds are he's going to be long gone with the worm slayer before you even get close to there. So you might as well just let him take it, unless you're willing to um let risk one of your unit's lives. Oh, but right now, first thing you want to do is you want to advance your units as far as you can. Like, just run. Because these guys are going to come across the water and try to assault you. Just don't open the door, either, because that's a bad idea. Just keep on moving. And try to head over there for that village over there. Yeah, as you can see, I did arena training. I bought a few. I bought actually a lot of weapons from the um the armories. Just buy as many weapons as you possibly can. It's really, really it's. You'll be glad that you bought a lot of weapons from there. So there's there's a bunch of pirates. There's a lot of axe users in this level. So we're gonna make a rad go up there. Remember to get Wolf and Zedgar a lot of XP because they're you really can't arena train them due to the fact that their stats are super low to start out with. So. Make sure to give them and Merrick a lot of XP. Just keep that in mind. I also bought some new tomes for Merrick. I bought him a new uh, new fire, new thunder, and it's a new one called a blizzard. You'll be able to find all this stuff in the um in that uh, big area of sh uh, places in chapter eight. Skip. How do you skip again? There we go. Alright, so yeah. Now we battle. Haha, -ha, you fail. <clears throat> Marth, head for the village. This is not going to work out well, will it? Haha, you can now not access the village. You dumb thief. Thieves are so dumb. Why are they so dumb? I don't know. Oh god, Lena's gonna die. We must stay behind and protect her. I 
Oh, I did not see that coming. Yeah, keep in mind that mm, he's going to try to be dumb and attack Frey, okay. Mm, you go there. Oh, God. I don't like that. There. Shield. Rad is a meat shield now. I do not appreciate that. You know, we're going to attack these idiots full force. Kanan said Gar can handle it. Oh, I did not know that guy had a hand axe. Yeah, watch out for hand axes, definitely, because these guys have a lot of them. Oh, yeah, don't mess with Kane, buddy. Frey meat shield for the win. You get this retard named George. And he's so retarded that they decided to spell his name with a J. He's a pre-promote sniper, which is a thing you... It's a promoted version of an archer. He seems super powerful at the beginning, like every other pre-promote in the game. Except for these guys, of course, Wolf and Sedgar. But he ends up sucking. Just, I mean, look at those stats. He, he, the thing that's good about him, though, is you get a free silver bow. Um, but, yeah. Just, no, we, we don't want you to fight. Just get out of here. So basically, we're going to just want to keep... Okay, don't. No, okay. Alright. Hunter coming this way. Abel's a little hurt. Anyone else coming? No, no one else is coming, so we're just gonna... We're gonna have Marth stand right here as a meat shield. And... Uh, um, okay. Let's see what we're going to do here. Okay, just don't use George at all. He's pointless. Um, actually, he does have. You can always use him a meat shield. It's a viable option. Okay, so yeah, he's going to steal the Worm Slayer. We're not even anywhere close to him yet. So don't worry about it. Oh yeah, and this is a pain. There's going to be a bunch of pirates spawning here. And there's, they're just going to continuously spawn for like a bunch of turns. And it's so annoying. Oh yeah, and Wolf, since my Wolf is a Berserker, he can, um, he can walk on water. So that's, because Berserkers are, a uh, are promoted pirates which are these guys these idiots <clears throat> Marth can slay him and now just continue on with your advancing I'll take his sword out because Pretty much all that's here is, um, uh, pirates. <clears throat> my mic is almost, like, literally touching my mouth, so if it's not loud enough, I don't know what the problem is. Okay. They're going to run toward us like idiots. Yippee. Advance forth! And basically what's going to happen is these pirates are going to um, run across the river and attack you from here, like, head on. So just be prepared for that.
okay, yeah, the thief's gone. We don't really care. There's many other worm slayers that you can get throughout the game, so don't fret. Just keep them out of their range for now. We don't really want to battle them just yet. Actually, keeping... Yeah, a lot of these guys have hand axe. Oh, bugger. All right, so that's the um the timer for um Okay, yeah. I'm not using the online timer anymore. I'm just using my phone. It's so much easier. But I think we can maybe go on for like a minute more. So let me just wrap up this turn and the next turn and then we'll end the video here. God, will we have to go 3 for this video? Yikes. I don't want that to happen. Actually, we can go for longer because the, the, the limit's 15 minutes, so I don't need to worry. Did he just... Okay, he has... That was... That's bad. That's bad. Let's just try and see what happens. <laughs> that's the magic of RNG right there, people. 44% chance, and he lands both hits. Wow. Wolf, you are amazing, my good fellow. Oh, God, and there's Hunter. I did not see these guys coming at all. Oh, well. Navar can be the idiot. Oh, he can one-shot kill that guy. I don't know. We'll just... Actually... I don't want him wasting his silver sword uses just yet, because, yeah, once your units turn B weapon ranks... Right here, they can use silver weapons, which are the best. Well, but besides, like, the holy weapons that you get near the end of the game, silver are going to be your best. So, yeah. Uh, Rad likes to fight, too. We can move Rad and Kane into the ranges. I don't see any harm in doing that. And keep these guys in the back as support people. So they're going to attack. They're really not going to do much harm, though. If you have arena trained, they're not going to do much harm. But let me tell you, arena training is so boring. But it has to be done because, well, I mean, it's kind of hard to get everyone that you want to level 20. Um. Hmm. See, like, all of these guys, all, like, bolt. A bunch of them have hand axes. One of them has a hammer. Two of them have hand axes. And another one of them has um, a steel axe. Let's see here. Just one shot kill that guy. And we're going to throw Wolf or Sedgar or whatever, whoever he is, in here. And we're going to... Oh, God. That that did more damage than I... I thought he would miss at least. Okay. Oh, well, we always have Lena using the physics staff back here. So if we have any problems, she's got us covered. Now, I don't want to go too far over time. Okay, he has a D sword ranking now. That's good. Um, move Rat a little closer. All right, I think that's gonna be it for this video. Um, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'm gonna be making part two right after this. Bye.